Hi guys, this is Shayanti and you are welcome to India.com Lifestyle. Hope you all are enjoying the videos that we are bringing to you. Well, today I have something really special for you. While there are so many anti-aging creams doing the rounds in the market, you want to make sure that your natural beauty stays and gets enhanced naturally. Well, the best solution is that of yoga. Yes, while you can do yoga for your entire body and also the mind like they say, it is something that is very effective for your face as well. There are a few chosen exercises which if you do consciously, you will actually see the difference on your wrinkles and the texture of your skin. Here they are. The best part is that you don't actually need any equipment to try them out. Well, it will just require 10 minutes of your day to fit it into the routine. So why don't you begin with a regime right away? I will show you what to do. Make sure that you have a relaxed face to start out with. Your mind does not have any stress on it and just be there with yourself. Use the me time to try out something which will actually benefit you. So you would want to face the mirror initially while you want to start out. You can imagine that you are actually blowing a balloon. So to begin with, if you think actually blowing out a balloon will help you, take a balloon and start blowing it. Because the pose that we are looking at is actually to blow out your cheeks so that this portion of your muscles which are hardly in use apart from speaking and eating actually gets worked out and in a nice way. So all you need to do is imagine that you have a balloon that you need to blow and just go this way. Do it for a count of 10. Just count it mentally because while you're doing it, every time you're supposed to blow and stop and blow again so that your muscles get relaxed and then stretched at the same time. And it will ensure that there is blood circulation flowing around this area, which is of course the best area because you want to always enhance your cheeks and the cheekbone. The other thing that we used to do as a kid is that of blowing a whistle. Well, you can actually do it more consciously this time. Even if you do not want to actually get hold of a whistle and blow it, do the same action that you would have done as a kid. All you need to do is imagine that there is a whistle in front of you and blow it. So this is actually like whistling. If you want to whistle, you can do it with your mouth as well. While you're doing this, your lips are actually coming in the O shape. And this will actually stretch out all the muscles in this area along with the chin and the jawline to make sure that there is nice blood circulation here. You can also try out what is more popularly known as the fish pose. This might be a little advanced because if you haven't done it earlier and if you have any issues around your jawline, you may not be able to get that perfection, but you can still try it on. So here it goes. Hold this pose for a count of five to begin with, because sometimes you might feel that it is stretching a lot around your lips. And those who are having some kind of pimples or rashes or allergies, might find a little bit of itching initially because this is a very sensitive area around the mouth. Once you're able to do that, this will make sure that you gain a lot of symmetry around your face. The other exercise that you need to do in order to ensure that you do not get a double chin which doesn't look pretty, you just need to nod your head up and down. Here's how it goes. So stand firmly with your feet on the ground Look straight and first go like this. You can keep the breathing normal and as you go, you will feel a stretch around your neck. Just hold it for two seconds so that you get a pull on the muscles here and this actually becomes very effective in ensuring that there is no fat log here. 
And the last exercise that you should definitely try is to make sure that there is a even blood flow all over your face and the neck. That is the overall moving your head in 360 degrees with a count of 5. In this 360 degree workout that you're trying for your head, you want to make sure that you rotate clockwise first, then anti-clockwise, and then just jerk your head on both the sides in front and back so that you can gain balance and do not feel giddy. So guys, these were some of the five exercises that I personally do every day to make sure that I do not need to apply anti-aging cream right now in my life. So just make sure that you try out facial yoga and look your best always. This is a natural way to go and you are definitely going to benefit from it. This is Shanti signing off. Hope you like the videos that we are putting together for you on India.com Lifestyle. Do let us know what more you would like to see.